Hey guys, what is going on? My name is NoJ456, and we have finally figured it out between me and my subscribers. We have finally, finally, finally figured out how you unlock this darn cutscene that we have seen. I have it uploaded to my channel if you would like to see it with the audio and everything like that. It is on my channel. A link will be in the description down below. But today, I'm going to be showing you guys how you actually unlock the cutscene. This is pretty much 95 to 100% confirmed. I haven't done it myself simply because I haven't had time, but a ton of my subscribers have been tweeting me, letting me know, and uh, just through all the research and pretty much what what everyone's been saying is that this is a very very specific process that you have to do now this person tweeted me he says i rescued three survivors on round 29 with two people playing i had a mark 25 magnetron and did the easter egg now this is the kind of stuff that i've been seeing but this is not correct this is uh i, I mean thank you again for the t the tweet king kipper and uh thank you all for uh for helping me figure this out but it turns out the way you actually unlock the cutscene and the way you actually get it and uh it's available in story mode is that you have to rescue 25 survivors now this completely makes sense to me this definitely definitely is something that they uh, that they would would put into the game it's it's an aspect that makes you actually go after the survivors because there is no use for them at all I mean obviously if you don't save them you get the power drain if you do save them you get a free rep we we weapon upgrade but it is not worth it in any other aspect of the game to to save these darn survivors because it's so difficult they almost die every single time and uh, it's just kind of ridiculous to try to save them and this gives them an actual purpose there is an achievement for saving 20 survivors that's kind of accumulated across all the games you save five more you will unlock the final easter egg kind of uh outro cutscene or anything like that so it's not really attached to the easter egg at all kind of like the previous maps were the previous cutscenes were where you finish the easter egg you get a cutscene blah 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 it is not like that at all it's his own separate entity and uh, it kind of makes sense to me i'm not really a fan of the way they uh they kind of give you the ending you can finish the easter egg but you don't get the cutscene that's kind of frustrating to me but uh again the this is, this is just how they chose to do it and uh, how they chose to go about their zombies game, which is uh, totally okay by me. They can choose how to do it, and it's obviously not going to be exactly what we want every single time. However, that is about it for the map. We have pretty much discovered everything that you can discover with this map, with the exception of maybe a few different things that we'll, we'll kind of find later on. But all of the major stuff, for the most part, has been discovered. Easter egg's done. Outro cutscene is done. The intro cutscene is done. Uh, the the kind of different Easter eggs with the alligators, where if you, if you start up the instigator four different times, it'll start playing playing some Atari noises, all that stuff has been found out, and unless there's any sort of major, major discoveries, I am pretty much done with this map until the next DLC and done with uh, Exo Zombies until the next DLC. Now, if Custom Zombies is something that you guys want to see, if uh, if playing just kind of Black Ops 2 Zombies is something that you guys want to see, let me know in the comment section down below and let me know by leaving a like on this video, and if this video gets kind of enough support and uh, people are really, really interested in seeing that, I will begin to upload that, and as well as just GTA 5, GTA 4, and and uh, all the other games I usually upload and that kind of content. Anyway, guys, thank you again so much for watching. Thank you again for all the support. I will see you guys in the next video, and goodbye.